captains. The Niners named their captains. I'd like to get your opinion on if anyone got snubbed and why. So starting with the offense, George Kittle, Trent Williams, Raheem Mostert, Jimmy Garoppolo. Then on defense, you got Eric Armstead, Fred Warner, Jimmy Ward. What are your thoughts? Which one do you like the best? Uh, and which one do you th- – who got who got snubbed in your opinion, if anyone? Because this is really important. These are the topics and the issues that will make or break the season. Um, I, I don't know if anyone necessarily got snubbed, but I think one person who is the next guy out is Kyle Juszczyk. Um, he's one of the longest tenured players on this team. He's been with the 49ers regime since they've – um, come to Santa Clara with Kyle. So I think if anyone should be on this list that isn't, it's juice. But I think the 49ers did a, a good job with all the guys they put out there. The one I do like the most is Raheem Mostert. I, I mean, you got to love that right. story with Raheem Mostert. First time. And with, yep. And with him potentially, you know, maybe not being on the team in, in 2022 with his contract situation, um, y- you never know. So I-, I think this is a good thing that the 49ers did by making Raheem, Raheem Mostert a captain. I, I really like that. Uh, I, is Raheem Mostert the special teams captain? Or no, like, I don't think I, they have a special teams captain. Oh, okay. I don't think he plays special teams anymore. Yeah, that's what I was wondering because yeah. I thought teams did special teams captains as right. well. So, um, But, yeah, I agree 100%. I think they got someone at every level essentially a quarterback or running back a pass catcher and offensive lineman, defense lineman, linebacker and DB. And I think they picked the guy in each group that I would pick if I was coming from scratch. Uh, I'm not going to give my obvious answer. You know, I've been on the heaven like a decal all, all, all show, but um, I don't think nobody got snubbed per se. Um, now I do have a question though. Is there like before on, on each side or is it, you said three and four, right? And four on offense. Yeah, on they, they have four on offense and three on defense. So you could, they could have theoretically had four on defense and three on offense. Right. Okay. I, yeah. I would like to see maybe one more guy. You know what I'm saying on, on defense. Yeah. Um, as far as Jimmy, they, they made Jimmy a captain just for this the sake of making a no quarterback. Captain, man. Yeah. You know what I mean? Right. You know. So. Yeah. Um, next question. Yeah. All right. I I mean, to me, I guess my one, you guys, it's a good point. Like, I feel like there should have been a spot for Jason Verrett, but not at the expense of Jimmy Ward. I think if you're picking one DB, then Ward should be it. But Verrett has got all the makings of a captain. I'm glad that they took away Mike McGlinchey's captainship after one year. That didn't go well for him. It just shows you that these things mean something. I mean, for so it set the wrong tone for him. And now he's back to just focusing on himself and not the whole team. That's good. But one more guy, like Eric Armstead, mm, he's the guy on the D line. I mean, I get it. He's like the he's like the senior member. And he's like the highest paid player. Still though, I don't know. He's versatile. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, it would be Buckner, but he's not here, and they kept right, him right. instead of Buckner. So I guess that's why. But honestly, shouldn't it be Bosa? No, shouldn't it be Bosa? It should be Bosa, right? So why is it not? I would, I would love to see that. that exactly. Get out of my head, Charles. That's exactly what I was thinking, yeah. right? I guess of, of like the the Mike McGlinchey Award of the player who's not good enough to be a captain this year to me would be Armstead. Like you're not a bad, you're a good player, but oh, you know, Mostert, Williams, Kittle. I mean, also Jimmy. But Jimmy, I mean, the quarterback gets it by default. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Armstead would be the one, the, but he's better than McGlinchey. I'll, I'll give him that. But he gets the McGlinchey. Anyway, use check should there should have been a spot for use check. Everyone should be a captain. That's what I think. Everyone should be a captain. Hey, way, I say, though, speaking of juice, I know they call him juice, but due to um in that quarterback play so far, he has been more like Tan Pico. So now <laughs> with uh in the passing game, I mean, he's a hell of a blocker. But with a better quarterback play, I'm telling you, he, he gonna be hundred percent grade A juice. Hey, you know, so Juice might be I'm, the only one who can catch Trey Lance's passes. Juice got some good hand-eye coordination. I'm, hey, Juice is a threat in the passing game with a competent quarterback. Trying to tell him, yeah, I said it. I said it. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Comp of V is coming to you, Mav. He says, at Mav, your ducks just got quacked by and got lucky. Go dogs. <laughs> uh, I don't know what dogs. He's talking about Fresno State, Washington. There's too many dogs. Get a unique mascot. 
Yeah, and he's based. The only the only mascot that's like more generic than the dogs is the Wildcats. That's the mm. worst mascot. The Wildcats do better. <laughs> 